Colebrook Kitchen. We love the flavor of smoke in a lot of foods, but sometimes traditional low and slow just takes too long. So we found this new cool tool, a really convenient and easy way to impart smoke flavor to all your foods in about 25 minutes or so. This is the Cameron's Stovetop Smoker. The Cameron stovetop smoker is really easy to use. You simply pull on this ring to remove the lid. And underneath you'll find, first of all, these really conveniently stowable handles that get out of the way but give you something easy to use when the thing gets hot. Now, in here you'll find a drip can and a rack. We're going to take some foil and cover the drip pan to make cleanup really easy after the protein has been cooked in, in the smoke. Then you take some vegetable oil and you give the rack a quick wipe, again, to make sure things don't stick and to ensure easy cleanup. So what you're going to do is smoke your meat in this pan and in the bottom of the pan, you're going to place the wood chips. Now, depending on what you're going to be smoking, you decide on which flavor of wood chips you want to use. And it's a, there's a full range of wood chips available that have been cleaned up, made resin-free, so they will do the optimal job in smoking your protein. Tonight, we're going to smoke some salmon that's been marinating in citrus and herbs. And so we're going to use the traditional Northwestern alderwood as our smoking. You use about a heaping tablespoon and you just put it down on the bottom of the pan. Real simple and straightforward. Then you place the drip pan and the rack in the smoker and you take out your protein. Here's this beautiful piece of salmon and we're just going to lay it right on top. So now you've placed the salmon on the rack, you take the lid and you put it on the top of the smoker and you close it most of the way shut. And now we're going to place it on the burner and when it begins to heat up, you'll see that one whiff of smoke come up, then you shut the lid firmly and let it smoke for the prescribed amount of time. So, I place it now on the top of a single burner. You can see that this whole pan fits easily on a single burner. You put the heat right under where the chips are inside the smoker, and that's all it takes. That's all you need to use to achieve these results. Now you see the first puffs of smoke coming up through the open lid. So we're going to shut this down tightly and let it cook for 25 minutes for this piece of salmon filet. So, it's been about 25 minutes. The handles are still cool. We're going to turn off the heat. We're going to move the smoker over to this trivet and serve it. First thing we're going to do is be very careful because the top is hot. So we're going to use tongs pull that lid off. And there's our salmon. And now we're going to serve it right off the skin. On the plate. Not too gracefully as it would appear. But it's really delicious can't communicate to you how wonderful this smells. But you can hear how the drip pan has collected all the drip. Your pan is going to be clean and easy to, easy to clean up. So now we've served this beautiful piece of salmon. It's been smoked in the Cameron smoker. And we're going to take a bite and savor all this extra flavor that's been imparted. Mmm. 
by the Cameron smoker using alder for this salmon. Thanks for visiting us at Colbert Kitchen.